Hi there, so today we're going to show you a really nice stretch aimed at improving uh, spinal rotation. So that includes your mid back, your ribs and your lower back. So first off, we want to just check to see how much rotation we do have in the, in the back. So this is a nice simple test is just to twist one way, see how far you can get before you start to feel a pull and then go give way. So for me, I'm a little bit more restricted turning to the right. So I'll show you a nice way of improving that. So you start off by lying on the floor, feet flat, knees together. And because I want to improve right rotation, my knees are gonna go towards the left. So we start off by bringing the right hand out to the side and that's a nice counterbalance. And we're gonna let the legs drop down until we start to feel a stretch in the lower back, in the ribs, or in the mid back. <clears throat> so that's our first barrier. What we then do is we take our other hand, so this is my left hand, and I'm gonna hold onto the thigh. And then we're gonna push our thighs into the hand for about five seconds. And after five seconds, relax, and see if the weight of the legs just allow that stretch to go a little bit further. So we're gonna hold that for 10, and after 10 seconds, we're going to push into the hand again. So what's important is we're pushing, but we're holding the same position. So you find when I push, the knees aren't going back towards the midline. So we're going to push for five, and then relax. And you may find again, your knees just drop down a little bit further. It may not go further every time, but um, after we do a couple of rep like a few repetitions, three or four or five repetitions, over a week or so, you will start to find that your knees will go further um, towards the floor, therefore more rotation without as much of a pull. So I've done that a couple of times there. And if I retest my rotation, and I find I can go much further to the right of the gym. So give that a go.